Back on the corner. Chuck reporting for you. Where's my light? Let's take a walk and have a talk. We go over there. Follow us. Okay, let's take a walk. Here. Leu Car Road Lane 3. We walked here before. We did take a walk before. Oh, I can recommend. I can recommend the pork over here. <laughs> this is really nice pork at the corner. Uh, we're going across the street. Or on the sidewalk. Because we noticed if we take uh, the zebra, the crossroads, they stop. They do stop. Sometimes, if it's convenient, yes, and now it is. So we cross the street here. Now I always forget the right name of this street. I think it's Sridon Shire Road. Ah, it will in the. I will. I will put it in the screen. Here we are. Uh, walking the street it uh, has been uh, several weeks since we walked the street and then we started at the same point but we walked the other way then I was talking about comparison compare it with videos from half a year ago but then I noticed half a year year ago we walked in a different direction yeah we walked in this direction so yes again we were at the hair saloon because I have to have my nails done yes I'm not a farmer I'm not a plumber so I can have my nails done once in the several weeks and then we go to uh, E First Saloon E First Saloon E First Saloon is uh, our favorite hairdresser they used to be uh, next to the boxing stadium yes Lane 3A next to the boxing stadium and uh, in, a, in a building there's now a carnival, new carnival bar is, uh, is at the same location as the hair salon used to be and you know cherry bar number two yes it is on the same location as the old carnival used to be so it's all connected yes it's all connected history my history our history our story of Chiang Mai and why we do the things we do always the same yeah some are uh, almost complaining it's always the same because yeah we have a regular life <laughs> about life about life of an expert living in Chiang Mai now I'm here for one year and four months almost five almost one and a half year and uh, yeah, as an expert living in Chiang Mai, you do need a hobby because without a hobby, you would be bored. You have to have something to do all day. Normally, you will be retired or early retired or some variation and then 
you have some extra time on your hands you cannot spend it in the bar every day not every day so yeah you have to find a hobby some people they have walking as a hobby walking was never a hobby for me but now I do take a walk as an exercise yes as an exercise because I couldn't walk for four months here is some interesting interesting building no idea what it is it looks like a temple but it also looks like a school it is a temple complex this there is the temple part of it here and this kind of places you find everywhere everywhere in Chiang Mai it's, it's so common beautiful places if you are interested <laughs> in the culture cultural things now we're almost at the corner of the moat and then we can check the name of the street uh, I always forget because I have a memory of a peanut I think it's Street on Shire Road let's have a check we're at the corner of the moat it's the east southeast corner yes you see the Asian wall over there and there's the sign can you read the sign no Yes, my memory is not that bad. Street on Chai Road. On the corner of Gang uh, Road. Okay, now we have to cross the street. Yeah. So here at the corner of the moat. Ra Chai Klan Road. Over there. Over there will be uh, Leukere Road. We are heading back. I want to cross the street, but not here. Because the street over there, there's uh, another zebra point. Come. Yeah. The zebra seems to work. And then we walk back. And we have enough, not for today, because it will be a long day. It's a weekday, it's a Monday. It's my birthday. So I'm going to cross the street, holding the camera because it's working. <laughs> uh, it's not that busy. Day, but it's about three o'clock something like that it's about three o'clock and here I thought here was the, the the shop with the yeah but it's Monday <laughs> probably they are closed at Monday where you can buy your big puppets yeah and then here's another soy if you travel the soy over here, you will end up again at Leukere Road. Oh, okay, we continue the walk on a Monday afternoon, Monday afternoon in Chiang Mai, Thailand, Freedom Chai Road. We're heading back to uh, Leukere Road, lane three, to the hairdresser. 
the barber shop. Follow us, come. Not there, over there. <laughs> Yes, uh, as an expert in Chiang Mai, in Thailand, you have to have a hobby. Um, uh, I have a great hobby, I'm making uh, YouTube videos. It takes me uh, a lot of time to edit them. I always like to make one-shot videos because then you don't have to edit them then I have nothing to do during the week and they are not that well watched because they are missing an intro, they are missing an outro now you will have noticed there is an advertisement on the channel again yes because we were kicked off the partner program, the YouTube partner program, it arranges the advertisement on the channel and uh, they didn't recognize my address because my address was still set as my Dutch address and I don't have any Dutch address anymore. And then they want to check it. So it took me several weeks because they sent the pin code to an address you don't have. Yeah, it took me several weeks to reset it. Now it seems to be reset. And now there are advertisements on the channel. Not earning anything because the. Yeah. The views are low, but the advertisement rate for a channel like our channel, uh, it sends. And then, there are a great number of videos, they are not monetized because they are coming from the bar. And they have music from the bar. That's why many of those YouTubers, they are... Uh, a little panic about uh, music there are some videos without music or maybe I can put some music under it as a background music although the music of the street is already rather loud maybe we can put on some background music but then it will be well chosen. Ah, here you have a massage. Savadikra. <laughs> Not today. Yes, friendly people in a massage shop. They uh, are not that, uh, how you call it, demanding. No, not at all. They're just friendly. Here we're walking with just I'd like to show you uh, Chiang Mai at the end of March. It's getting warmer. It's still dry, although it did rain. Last night, was it last night? Oh, the night before. There was even a storm. The storm was so hot, it was in the European news. What's that? Bug with many feet, but it died. Yeah, it was a, a, a storm, hailstorm with uh, big hailstones, and it was even in the news in the Netherlands because the damage in Chiang Mai and some roof was blown away. So it did rain. Still, it's not rainy season. Still, it's not rainy season. Rainy season will start after Songkran. That's why we celebrate Songkran. Songkran is some kind of fertility festival. 
and they say this year we're gonna celebrate it big not three days not five days seven days now seven days is a little bit too long for me three days will be enough and that will be half of April 15 April something like that now we're back back at the pork shop the lady selling the small bowls can recommend the small bowls because they are tasty we're back at the saloon we're back at Loy Car Road lately back at the corner so thank you for watching support the channel on the buy me a beer page because yes I'm thirsty like and subscribe and I see you later I see you later